Oil is holding steady and is testing new highs. Traders seem to have downplayed the rise in U.S. crude inventories as well as the surge in new COVID-19 cases in the U.S. Oil bulls are now heading for the next level of resistance at 45 U.S. dollars per barrel. On the Wednesday, oil closed the session reaching its highest level since March 6. The rise in oil prices came after the U.S. Energy Department published its report on crude inventories. The data showed that for almost a month, U.S. crude oil production has been holding near 11 million barrels a day. The build-in stockpiles reported earlier by the American Petroleum Institute and the Energy Information Administration can be explained by an increase in oil imports. This is actually a good sign, indicating a recovery in fuel demand in the country. Yet, the reaction of traders was surprisingly calm. Previously, a surge in oil inventories by 5.6 million barrels would trigger a collapse in oil quotes by at least one or two dollars. Probably investors are tired of market shocks and determined to continue the uptrend. However, the spike in coronavirus cases can restrict the upward movement of crude prices. The United States reported 60,000 new COVID-19 cases in a single day. And this is the biggest increase reported in the country since the outbreak began. Such states as California, Hawaii, Idaho, Missouri, Montana, Oklahoma and Texas are seeing the largest number of infections. Brent oil futures for September settled at $43.27 per barrel. WTI contract with the nearest expiration is trading at $40.76 a barrel. In the day session, both benchmarks were moving slightly lower, having lost 0.02%. The ruble has notably eased after the Bank of Russia announced it was going to reduce its foreign exchange purchases by almost a half. Yet the news did not come as a surprise to traders, as it has already been priced in the quotes. On Wednesday, the Russian Ministry of Finance held a successful placement of federal loan bonds. However, this factor did support the ruble, as well as the data on oil reserves. At the moment, the ruble is recovering from early losses. It's now going through the technical correction to consolidate in the narrow sideways channel. The dollar-ruble pair is trading near the mark of 70.80. The Russian currency feels comfortable at this level and does not react strongly to negative external factors. So today, the ruble is likely to stay trading in the range between 70.40 and 70.80 against the US dollar. In the short term, the ruble may follow the trajectory of other currencies of emerging markets. Their dynamics will be determined by the situation around the coronavirus spread and the US-China relations. That's all for now. Thank you for watching and stay tuned.